Hi, welcome to a brand new video. Today we're going to be answering the question, what is seasonal depression? Why am I asking this question? Well, my therapist said that um, my depression might be seasonal. Now I've been diagnosed with depression for about three years now, and I didn't really take any medicine, um, mainly because I didn't want to be on that kind of stuff. But my therapist says that my depression might be seasonal. How I understand um, seasonal depression is that during the colder months or during the months where you're having less vitamin D, um, that's when you tend to be saddest because you have a lot of vitamin D deficiency, but also because you have depression. So um, I'm going to be doing a blood test today to find out if I have a vitamin D deficiency because it's right now December 16th. Now, if I could get the official definition of um, seasonal depression it is. All right, so it says, seasonal affective disorder or SAD is a, it's a type of depression that's related to changes in seasons. SAD begins at the end at about the same times every year. If you're like most people with, with SAD, your symptoms start in fall and continue into the winter months, sapping your energy, making you feel moody. Well, they don't call me very moody for nothing. But point is, around the same time every year, um, I'd say about October, November, that's when I start becoming saddest. So, you know, there could be a, how you say, um, there could be a correlation, but basically we're gonna try to answer the question um, if I have it and uh, see what we can learn about it basically. So, uh, come with me. So I'm recording this about, I don't know, like three days later. Uh, finally, the results came back in and turns out I don't really have any major deficiencies. My blood levels are abnormal, except for the fact that I do have a slight vitamin D deficiency, which does mean that I will have to take some medicine, but it's not going to make a huge difference, but it's just uh, to make things a little better. But that does still raise the question, even though I'm, I'm, I'm still technically regularly depressed, what is the difference actually between regular depression and seasonal depression? Now, first off, regular depression basically contributes to all aspects of your life. Um, you tend to have low energy levels, you tend to have uh, less motivation, more anxiety to do things. Uh, it depends on the person in terms of the anxiety, whether it be public speaking, whether it be meeting new people, whether it be during certain situations alone or with others. It really depends, but it basically halts their ability to actually do what they want to do almost, and just not even wanting to do them in the first place. And a lot of sadness, and there tends to be some suicidal thoughts, but that's at the extreme side of the spectrum. Now, Seasonal depression, otherwise known as SAD, comes in two different forms. The first form of SAD is spring and summer SAD. Basically, in the spring summer SAD, you have usually trouble sleeping, you have a loss of appetite, and there t that tends to lead to a bit of weight loss, and uh, high levels of anxiety. So basically, the other type is uh, winter and fall SAD, which is what my doctor believed that I had. Now, the flip side of this is that you have a high um, lusts for food, mainly carbohydrates, you have massive weight gain, you have very low motivation to do anything, like your energy levels are very low, and, and you tend to oversleep, which I was showing a lot of those tendencies. Now, of course, uh, that also has a contribution with uh, low vitamin D levels, but seeing as I only have a slight lower great in that. That kind of shows that I don't really have seasonal depression, but I still have regular depression. So the key difference between the two we can say is that one is more consistent than the other. One is more dependent on external values or external forces rather than the other one is more internal, at least from how I understand it and what I've looked into. And yeah, once again, I'm kind of new to this whole research stuff, so please correct me in the comments down below. Don't bash me though. I'm still learning how to do this stuff, and you know, to be honest, I'm nervous as hell to do this. 
but yeah so next um, I'm gonna be showing you guys how I would take my vitamin D pills as I'm gonna be apparently there's a special way to do it I don't know we're gonna figure it out if not then this segment is kind of for nothing and we're just gonna go right to the outro Hey, so I'm sitting here editing the video and I realize I don't really have an outro because my meds never actually came. So uh, I'm going to be kind of doing this outro now. So uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to smash a like. If we can get 10 likes on this, share this around. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and all that. And uh, sources down in the description on uh, where I found my resources for the seasonal depression. And if you enjoyed, please again, share it around. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya. And we won't have to cry no more.